you might be wondering how you can go ahead and basically add applications to Android Auto. Now, doing this is actually very basic and it really doesn't take that much time. So what you're going to want to do is you want to go ahead and open up your settings application. Just go and open up settings. And then what you want to do is you want to go and search up Android Auto like you normally could. So click on Android Auto like this, and then you'll come into this panel. Now what you're going to want to do here is you want to go and click on this Customize Launcher button. So this Customize Launcher button, you can basically just click on like that, and you'll come into this page. Now what you can do here is you can basically just go through and choose whichever application that you want to basically be added into Android Auto. So you can see as I'm scrolling through, there's a few applications that are currently supported. Not every application you have on your phone may be there, but most of them should be here for the most part. So now what you can do is you can go ahead and find that specific application. So in this case, let's say I wanted news or whatever, I can just go ahead and choose whichever applications I want, and I can go and turn them off if I want to by clicking off that check mark. Or if I want to, I can go and add the check mark like this, and then I can go ahead and basically add an application like that, which is very basic. Now on top of that, if you want to add a shortcut to the launcher, you can go and click right here. And you can create shortcuts for calling a contact or an assistant action, meaning if you want to enable Google Assistant to do something when you are somewhere or if you want to say something, you can see that information right there too, which is pretty cool. So now what you can do is you can go ahead and even choose whichever application you want first. So if you want podcasts up there, or if you even want the phone application up there, you can just grab this like this and drag it up and you'll see that right there too. So that's basically how it's done. Super basic process. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button. That would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.